Alright, what's up guys? Welcome back. And let's continue our story. Get a relapse. It's very serious. Get up or get out. Oh, you can be so testy. What is it? Constipation? Guess you're my proof I'll never quite outrun my sins. You got so sanctimonious in your old age. No wonder she left you. It's like rooming with the King James Bible. <laughs> get up! Ow! I, I, I'm getting up. Oh, no, wait, what did I have to tell you? I, I went into town and oh, I, got, I got a little drunk. Uh, Oh, shit! Well, we gotta go. We gotta go to San Denis. Charles. Charles Smith is alive, I reckon. Charles Smith alive? Really? I, I reckon. Unless I dreamed it all, and by the sound of it, not doing too good neither. Come on, let's get off. All right. <sighs> Back in San Denis. I never liked this place. Oh, yeah. Oh, me neither. All right, let's go, Uncle. All right. Let's go find that big sour bastard. Sure. <sighs> let's split up. Good idea. I'll take the saloons. You take the slum. Now, uh, how about I take the saloons, and you take the slumps? Come on. Mm. Oh. Hey, look out. All right, so we're going to the saloon or slump. Let's go to this level. Or maybe likes fighting. Yeah, yeah. Bare knuckle guy. Think he's he's fighting tonight over at Saint Saturnine's. Thank you. Thanks a lot. No problem, but Thank you. awful taste in my mouth. Good work, Hello. Let's go, girl. What took you so long? Oh, good lord. I was just beginning to enjoy some peace and quiet. <laughs> Asked that first barman I met, and he told me Charles was here. <laughs> Not Folks, one of life's great love mysteries, surprise. turns out. They hate a massacre, and you are a killer. We both know what you gotta do. I'm leaving now. 
He don't know the half of it. John? You're... You're... I'm alive. <laughs> so are you. <sighs> So's he. That's uncle? What are you doing? I don't know. I'm alive. Uncle thought maybe he was in some sort of trouble. Kind of, kind of just... I don't know. I, I'm throwing fights for a few dollars. Throwing fights? Sure. And you like that? Of course not. So... So... Let me go place a bet. Come on. Man, I thought you were dead. Sure. Abigail's still alive, too, only she left me. Uh, excuse me. I'd like to place a bet. On who? On myself, to win. Lone Wolf. How much? All of this. Okay. Funny thing, I pegged you for the favorite, but the odds just got real good. What about you, sir? A uh, little wager on the wolf here? Real redskin brave. All right, let's bet on Charles. I'm a fan of the wolf. Give me a bet on him. Have I got a treat for you? An epic battle between the descendant of ancient warriors and a not-so-noble savage. On my left. A ferocious battle from the valleys, Simon of Wales. Come on, Charles. My right, an Indian Hercules. The savage, the untamable, the unbeaten, and dare I say unbeatable, lone wolf. You know how this works. No weapons, no forfeiting, no crying like a beaten child. Everything else goes. You win by knockout. You win by retirement. Or you win by death. Let's have a good fight, boys. Let's keep it clean, but not so clean. Pretend he's my cut. Knock him out. Don't black out just yet. Lone Wolf. Hit him, Lone Wolf. Come on, Charles. Try and stay on the field Come on, Lone Wolf. Gotta get you the hell out of here. Hey, Lone Wolf, whoa! How? Made my months, but you also made some fellas mighty unhappy. So it goes. Here's your share, partner. Okay, we took it. So you keen on staying around here or heading off with me and Uncle? But, John, I haven't seen you two in years. I know. But right now, my sense is you just need to lie low. Where? We got a little place up past Blackwater, in the high country. Okay. I gotta grab my baggage. I booked a steamer heading up river. That's why I was pretending to throw the fight. Okay, boys. I'll meet you at the bridge outside Saint Denis. What are you doing? Well, I'll just have a few urns to run. <laughs> You're useless. I. I'm a deep thinker. Be quick. Come on. All right, let's go. This way. Uh, my bag's on the dock side. So, what happened? You mean back then? Arthur helped me get out. Gave me a chance to live, I guess. You you know that Arthur... Sure. Word got to me up north, so I went back and buried him in Miss Grimshaw. I had to run. If any of us had been found, we'd have... Oh, of course. I understand. It's where he would have wanted to be. A pretty hillside, facing the evening sun. He gave me his satchel with some of his things in it. Remember that journal he always drew in? I got it. I'm a bit of a draftsman myself nowadays. He was a good man. As much as any of us could be. Getting sick like that has to rattle a fella. Rattle him or give him some kind of understanding of what his life was really all about. Yeah. That makes sense. 
Anyway, I heard all you were dead. Or I might have come looking. And me, the same about you. Dutch? Who knows? Dead? Maybe? I'm not sure. I heard all kind of things, but... One thing I know, he ain't around here. I ain't heard nothing real in years since... Well... That time. Nor me. Or Micah. I hope that bastard's dead. You know, he was the one speaking to them agents. What? Putting them on us the whole time. Or... Since before I got off Sisica, they picked up Strauss. The agents made a real mess of him. I heard he died in custody. Never said a word. <sighs> Guess some folk is strong in ways you can't see. Everything that happened, all those deaths, Micah. Okay. Uh, hold on. What? Careful. Why? Those are Guido Martelli's men. Who? He, uh, he used to work for Angelo Bronte. I've only been here an hour. Hey. Uh, Come over here. What now? Well, you go left, I go right. On three. Mm -hmm. Three. <laughs> you couldn't have thrown that fight! Except just one fight. Evidently! Alright, let's go. Come on, Charles. chance we have of denying it at least no we can't get caught martelli has the police chief in his pocket if they take us in we won't get out of the interview room i don't want to get a shootout over this that's not the man i try to be anymore no i don't want that either you see anything <sighs> i think we're clear if i ever want to go back remind me that i hate Saint Denis. Guido Martelli will happily remind you of that. Give me some simple folk and wide open spaces. Speaking of simple. John Charles! <laughs> you boys been all getting up to no good? Kind of. Been getting shot at. Let's go, boys. Well, they weren't very good shots. Come on, let's head for home. <laughs> Alright guys, I think that's all for this episode. Thanks for watching guys, and ciao.